championship heat in Evansville, Indiana. Here are the boats in lane number one, Cairo Choice. Lane number two, Miss Circus Circus. Lane number three, Miss Budweiser. Lane number four, Holson Miss Madison. And lane number five, the Winston Eagle. Trailing the field just a little off pace. Coming up inside lane number three is the Ark Construction Boat. Here they come down to the start. Chip Hanauer and Circus Circus trying to get the lead on the Miss Budweiser. They come down almost even Steven. Just a boat length difference between the two. It is Circus Circus on the start line. He has got himself a good start, and they are almost going to be neck and neck as they go into the turn. A great shot from the helicopter. Circus Circus on the inside of the Miss Budweiser. Miss Budweiser moving up on the outside, and there was a little bit of a tag of the wake by the Circus Circus, but Miss Budweiser holding on to the lead as they go down into the back straight. It's the Miss Budweiser. This is for all the money. There is no more today. First one to take the checker flag wins the event. As the Bud, whoa! The Budweiser came right out of the water. And Tommy never took his foot out of it, Dick. He certainly didn't. You can see both of the boats are very, very light. And here comes Circus Circus again as they come up. Even Steven. Circus Circus on the inside. The pink boat, the red and white boat on the outside. Tommy Deeth in the Miss Budweiser. Look at the lap speed. Oh! These boats are really valley. Two veteran drivers. They trust each other. They know. Now they're coming off of corner number two. Holding in tight is the Miss Budweiser on the inside the Circus Circus. A great challenge by Chip Hanauer to the Miss Budweiser boat. And as they come down, Tommy Deeth again tends to get a little bit light. This is something that Chip Hanauer is going to watch very closely out there. His boat got light, but Tommy's really got light coming out of corner number four. As they come off of corner number four. To complete lap number two after close to 145 mile an hour competition lap on lap number one. Here comes Circus Circus on the inside. Look at Tommy D and Miss Budweiser almost side by side. The crowd is going crazy. And they have a right to. These boats are deck to deck and look like they hit as they came around. Almost 141 miles an hour average speed as they go back into the turn. You'll never see better competition than this. Side by side coming off as the Miss Budweiser. Oh! The Circus! Circus Circus is up in the air. He almost lost it there, Dick. Circus Circus managed to come down. Chip Hanauer got off it right at the right moment. He's brought it back down, kept the power to it, and he's back in the race, still holding on to second place. And this was similar in Miami, but not as dangerous when the Miss Budweiser went up and Circus Circus stayed down and went on to win. Now Miss Budweiser has a little more comfortable lead as they come down to complete lap number three. Here's the art construction boat. Stephen David very happy to be in this final championship heat out here. He is trailing the field right at the moment, but right now I know he is still just happy to get that boat into competition. Meanwhile, on the outside up in the very fast Miss Budweiser, now at 138.626, he obviously has gotten a word about Chip Hanauer. He knows he has a comfortable lead at this point. He'll just try to keep that buffer zone in there. Crew and driver can speak with each other because there's radios built in the helmets. They know where the competition is. Here's your number two boat, Circus Circus and Chip Hanauer. What a great driver. I don't know how he controlled that boat, Nick. He certainly deserves a lot of credit for bringing the boat down without any apparent damage to it. They'll check it out carefully at the end of the heat for sure, but this is for the money. This is the championship. This is when you push the equipment as far as it'll go, and we have seen that happen out here today. Another good run by Mike Hansen in the Holson Miss Madison, holding on to fourth position in the field. There you see Miss Circus Circus riding in second on the left side of your screen, going past the bright yellow boat and putting the art construction boat down a lap on the rest of the field. And he completes lap number four. Lap number four has now been completed. Still fighting it hard, the Cairo Choice boat in fifth place, Mitch Evans, really the hometown entry out here. There you can see the leader going by. Not only the Cairo Choice boat, but also the Holson Miss Madison. Now the green flag is out for the lead boats, the Miss Budweiser, and this boat in second place, the Miss Circus Circus. Green flag signifying just one more lap to go. So if Chip Hanauer is going to make a move, he's going to have to make it right now. But I can't see that happening. The Miss Budweiser has been in command since the Circus Circus got very light coming out of court.
corner number two earlier in the race, and that gave him enough time to really put a good buffer in there and hold it. You can see, though, Chip Hanauer is still power on as he got the skid fin high and then brought the boat back down onto the water. This is your leader. The checkered flag is out for Tom Deeth and the Miss Budweiser. The championship in Evansville, Indiana today. This crew has got to be extremely happy. They have had literally a flawless day. Three new course records, two new world records, five records in all set for Miss Budweiser as the Circus Circus takes the checkered flag for second place. Certainly a good job by the Circus Circus crew and driver. Third place coming in, Jimmy Kropfeld aboard the Winston Eagle, and I know Steve Woomer has got to be feeling much better about it after they had faltered in the first two races earlier in the season. We'll be back to talk with the winners in just a moment. Here in Evansville, Indiana, the Ohio River, I'm Jim Hendrick along with Dick Griffin, and this race is now history. We have three races under our belt, and the first repeat winner of 1990 is the Miss Budweiser. Followed second place for this event by the Circus Circus, Winston Eagle, Miss Madison, Cairo Choice, and Art Construction. Let's go to the winner. Well, Tommy, two in a row. That's got to feel good. Oh, it certainly does. You know, uh, we're really happy about winning Evansville. I am especially, and I know Bernie is. And everybody at Anheuser-Busch is uh, two in a row. This is a real competitive season now. And uh, congratulations to Chip Hanauer and a great birthday present for me. Well, I got to tell you, you guys put on one of the greatest parody races I've seen all year. Well, Chip is really a champion driver, you know, and uh, he really makes racing worthwhile for me. And I'll tell you what, he's, he's, he's really a class guy. All right, Bernie, a little, a couple of uh, heart-stopping moments on shore. Yeah, I'm going to drink this whole bottle of Budweiser, really. I want to tell you that uh, I think that was one of the greatest races I've seen in my history, and deck-to-deck -deck dueling like that, and uh, they both know they're good drivers, and the Winston Eagle is coming on real strong, and he'll be right up there with us. All right, Bernie, were you a little bit concerned? You saw that cowling start to come on. Yes, I did, and yes, I was, and uh, I tried to get word to Tom to take it easy and make it last. <laughs> all right, Tom, when Chip was out there, all of a sudden, I don't know whether he caught part of the rooster tail or he hooked or something went wrong and he back, he went down on it. You didn't back off at all. No, not at all. I just uh, kept right on charge and I knew that uh, he wasn't going to give me any slack at all, so I just kept right on running the Budweiser girl right to the finish. Okay, any concern at all when that cowling loosened? Uh, no, not really. I mean, uh, Mr. Little tells me to bring it back in pieces, but when? <laughs> <laughs> now let's take a look at the action and I'm telling you, both these drivers, Tommy Deef, and look at the way Tommy comes up, loses control completely, flies the boat, comes back down, doesn't take his foot out of it. That means he was competitive all day, as was the man on the right. Miss Circus Circus driver Chip Hanauer. Neither driver giving an inch, coming very closely, just about touching at that point. Now look at the Circus Circus as the Budweiser starts to pull away off of corner number two. Circus gets airborne and almost loses it. But Chip manages to retain control. Well, Chip, you kind of threw a scare into some of the fans, I'm sure, about that. You should have been sitting where I was sitting. <laughs> it got way up in the air. It just rode the rooster tail up, and uh, I'm just lucky that it came down right side up. All right, luck played into it, but good driving, too. You guys, i got to tell you, you and Tommy put a show on that was just probably the best I've seen in a long time in unlimited hydroplane racing. Well, they got a really good piece down there right now, and uh, I just got to do the best I can with what I got, and uh, we gave him a race today. You gave him a run for the money. You're going to be back. This isn't it. Nah, you know, it takes a while. You wish, you know, you want to win everyone, and you know you can't. But I'm real proud of today. They, uh, they definitely had an advantage, and I think we threw our best shot at him, and it was a good shot, and uh, I'm proud of that. Strategy before Tommy went in, he said he was going to try for the inside, but he knew Chip Hanauer, and he says, if I don't get it, I won't fight for it. Uh, he fought for a while, and uh, we got it, and we had a good lead at the start, and I was real happy about that, and uh, just don't quite have the piece yet. All right, but next week you go back, you're into Madison, Indiana, and the uh, same river. Same river, uh, completely different race course, though. It's amazing how different the two race courses are, considering they are in the same body of water. This is short and fat. Madison's real long and real narrow, so it'll be a different race. 